Hi everybody, this is Dark Onion. Uh, this is a video on how to root the Droid 2 using the 1, 2, 3 uh, root process that we developed. Um, so let's get started. Here I have my Droid 2. Um, it is not rooted at the moment. I just unrooted it a few, few minutes ago. Um, yeah, so let's take a look. As you can see, uh, wireless tether should not work. Unable to start tethering. Please try again. Alright, so no root. Here we go. So uh, first thing we want to do is you're going to need these three files right here. Uh, there's an Android SDK, there's a USB driver, and there's the do root file which uh, we're going to be currently using 2.1.4. So first thing you want to do um, is download those and install the drivers, uh, which is right here. Um, just follow the directions, just open it up, install the Motorola drivers, follow the directions, install that. Uh, next thing you want to do is Android SDK. So here you're gonna see you're gonna see this Android SDK Windows folder. What you're gonna do is go to your your my computers and go to your C drive. Okay, and just drag and drop this over to here. Okay, so as you can see, I've already done that. Uh, once you do that, you're going to open it up and you're going to choose SDK Manager. What you need to do is you need to update one of the packages, and that'd be um, you're going to you're going to see the list here. What you want to update is SDK API 8 Revision 1 for 2.2. So just look for the 2.2 one and just update that one. You don't need to update anything else. You do need to do this step though. Okay. Once you're done with that, keep this tools, open this tools folder. Okay. And you want to open the the do root windows um, .zip file. And you want to drag and drop all the files into the folder. I've already done it, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, skip all these, but just overwrite anything that you haven't already done. Okay. Alright, so cool. We got that done. Alright. Alright, so the next thing you want to do is you need to make sure your phone is in USB deb debugging mode. So open the blind, choose USB connection, okay? You can use PC mode, which is this top one, or charge only mode. So I'm gonna use PC mode, okay? Press OK. And make sure you have, well, that's not working. But essentially what you want is you want to have this you want to have USB debugging enabled. USB debugging connected. Okay? Just debugging. Okay? Alright, so moving on. What we're going to do next is all you got to do is go to this folder, your tools folder, right? And look for the do root batch file. This one right here. Do root. Double click that. And this sucker is going to open. Okay. So you're just going to let it run. Okay. It's going to run the exploit. It's done. The exploit's done running. Now it's going to continue on for a few more things.
and that's it. That's how you root your phone. So let's go ahead and minimize this, and let's go ahead and check check the phone. We'll check wireless tether right here. Kick that sucker on, and there it is. Super user request. Wow. And that's how to root your phone. Pretty easy. Alright, so I uh, just want to say a quick few little things. Uh, so this is based off the Sebastian Kramer method. Um, the code was, uh, the procedure was written by Carnal Varen and the binary was uh, written by Sebastian Kramer. Um, the code to the scripts was written by me, Dark Onion, and by a uh, faceless user. So uh, we'd like to thank everybody out there that has helped us test the code and troubleshoot and all that goodie. So um, yeah. Alright, that's it. That's how to root the Droid 2 in less than 7 minutes.